messy. Some areas in the Eastern Cape live under old collapsing dwellings, mainly rondevels. This has caused a huge outcry from the health practitioners who are reluctant to serve in rural areas. All these uh, institutions were inherited from the missionaries. Ever since they've been taken over by the Department of Health, uh, there's uh, no improvement in terms of the conditions of where the nurses, uh, especially, in fact, all the health care workers where they reside, uh, you'll find that the conditions remain uh, uh, the same without improvement. The health department in the province says some strides are being made to ensure that staff members reside and work under conducive conditions. The department has embarked on a program to improve the availability of suitable accommodation by renovating the existing staff accommodation as well as building new units in our hospitals. Construction of staff accommodation at a number of hospitals like Sipetu, Nesinite, Khuzong and Janyana hospitals, including Major Clinic, has already been completed as part of this accommodation program. Dinosa says the state of these houses impacts negatively on health care offered in rural areas. We are hoping even this uh, will get uh, 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 prioritized. Otherwise, the, the condition is not um, uh, uh, motivating. As a result, the morale of the health workers in those institutions uh, needs to be boosted by ensuring that the conditions that they live in uh, are improved. The department says prefab units will be delivered to all affected health facilities as an interim measure. It is an interim measure to address the current situation. The department is procuring and installing prefab units in the affected institutions. Appropriate accommodation is part of ensuring a conducive environment for our health workers in and also serves as a means to attract scarce health professional skills to our deep rural areas. Old health facilities in the province that were inherited from the missionaries are mainly in bad condition. Healthcare workers say they want the government to prioritize their working conditions.